The Schiller Theater building was designed by Louis Sullivan and Dankmar Adler and is considered by many to be the greatest collaboration between the two. It was named after Friedrich Schiller, a German playwright, poet, and philosopher. Funding came from the publisher Anton C. Hessing and other wealthy Germans. It was projected to be used for German-language cultural events. After German investors backed out in the late 1890s, it ceased its German performances and became the Dearborn Theater and exhibited touring stage shows. It became the Garrick in 1903 and then began showing movies in the 1930s when it was acquired by the Balbin and Katz chain. It became a television studio in 1950 and returned to screening movies in 1957. When B&K announced it was going to tear down the Garrick in May of 1960, there was one of the earliest organized public outcries in Chicago to save the historic building. To no avail, as it was demolished a few months later and replaced with a monstrously ugly, multi-level parking garage. That was itself raised in the late 1990s. Parts of the theater were saved, and some of the terracotta busts of prominent German figures can be found scattered throughout the Lincoln Park neighborhood. Check out the link for a video on that part of the story.